Welcome back everybody to a brand new video on the channel. Today we are back with another, I guess, mini game video, but it's a different type of video because we go ahead and play in UHC mode, but with all of these mods that allow us to make armor out of any item in Minecraft. So it's pretty cool. And what I'm planning to do this episode is go ahead and make some bedrock armor because we can actually break bedrock in this version of Minecraft. So I'm gonna go ahead and break bedrock and make armor out of it. But if you guys do enjoy this video, be sure to go ahead and hit it with a like, comment down below any suggestions for future videos. And as always, be sure to subscribe with notifications turned on. But other than that, yeah, let's just hop straight into it. Minecraft UHC, but you can craft with anything. Oh yeah. Ready. 15 or 20 minutes, we'll see. Mm -hmm. And then we fight to the death. UHC gets turned on in three, two, one, go! Oh, oh, oh we're going right now? Oh, 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 okay, so we've all gone off into like our own different cools and stuff. But yeah, there's like a village here. I grabbed some carrots and it looks like Ian's already in the desert temple. Wait, did he already get it? What's he? Oh, it looks like he already got it. Oh no. Okay, so hopefully he didn't get too much good stuff there. But yeah, basically in this like, I guess mod pack, UHC thing you can craft any different type of armor out of any block and you can also create some pretty cool swords so to start off obviously we just gotta get some wood all that good stuff on those scissors already has iron oh this is bad this is bad but yeah we're gonna go ahead you know do all the classic stuff get some stone tools I think what we're gonna do is get bedrock armor because hey if we if we look in here um, and go to bedrock armor armor where is it where is it where is it yeah right here you can make bedrock armor you're immovable and you get a health boost and we made it so you can actually break bedrock on the server but it doesn't drop for some reason so you, basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna have to make a diamond pickaxe get out of here get out of here you butt and for every single bedrock I break, I'm going to be able to give myself one bedrock in creative and cheating mode. I'm sorry, but it's not dropping for some reasons and we didn't know how to fix it. But that's the way around it, okay? That's what we're going to do. And yeah, I, th I think it's going to be pretty fun because we're going to be running around in some bedrock armor. It's going to be pretty lit. Okay, but like I said, when you can make any different type of armor, you can make any different type of armor. So I think what we're going to go ahead and do is make ourselves some wood armor. So I'm guessing it's just like this. Yeah, there we go. Like that like that and then like that there we go wait wait what is this bot's already in cactus armor what what is wait <laughs> he says i can be but i can no 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 get out of here get out of here dude oh that actually does quite a lot of damage okay but at least i got my wood armor here to protect me he stole our crafting table dude he literally came over and just said nope this is our crafting table now anyway so yeah let, let's go ahead and get a few more trees and do i still have some wood okay i still have some wood so let's go ahead and get ourselves some stone tools as well okay here we go getting the stone getting all that cobblestone i think we need like nine cobblestone for all the tools why is nico okay I, I swear if they're calling me in bots i'm i'm just getting cobblestone okay you know the timer has only just started so I, th I think we're doing pretty well we got some stone and we got a full set of wood armor which isn't too bad they're all calling me a bot that's it's kind of mean if you ask me um but hey let's go ahead and make ourselves just some normal tools just to start off i wonder if you can make cobblestone armor wait you can you can make stone armor can you make cobblestone armor oh you can but it's only the same damage as the wood armor okay so i think i think we're good with our wood armor for now getting an upgrade there we go dude this this guy better get the heck out of my way wait i, th I think you can make a carrot sword and i don't know what it does here Carrot sword. Okay, wait, yeah, we can make a carrot sword right now. I want to see what this does. Hold up, where's my uh, crafting table? Here, crafting table. <laughs> Look at this thing, dude. Look at it. What is this? Okay, so it does three attack damage. It's slightly worse than a stone sword. Food level six. What does that do? Does that feed me, baby? I don't know. I'm going to hold on to it for now. But we've got to go find ourselves a cave. So let me let me go look for a cave here because we definitely need to get some uh, iron or something a little bit better. Because to mine the bedrock, we're going to need diamonds. So we gotta we got to get in these caves pretty fast, guys. Ian already got diamonds? Dude, he's already got diamonds and it's like... How, like five minutes into the game. Dude, I, I swear, I swear, Ian is probably one of the luckiest people in here right now. But hey, let's go ahead and kill these cows because if we get the leather, then we can use it to make an enchant table and get enchants and stuff. But we gotta find a cave to start off. And I, I'm not, oh, just as I asked for a cave, we got one. Okay, so let's go down in here and hopefully find ourselves some iron or some kind of upgrade for now because like I said, we're gonna need those diamonds if we want into the bedrock, you know? And for all of you guys probably wondering in the chat what the this credit book and why is it so big and this hot furnace do, basically the credit book is, I guess, a recipe book for all of these special uh, ingots and stuff. 
and we can only craft these special ingots in this furnace and it's really really hard to make and you have to go to the nether and all that kind of stuff so instead of doing that we're just going to go ahead and uh you know have have one each i think i think we've allowed ourselves for one each and we can make this deer menstruate steel I'm, i have no idea how to say that but you can use that to make things like this fire sword and i think i think you need to go to the nether for that actually might not be too hard to get that uh but you can make a bunch of a bunch of different things so we're gonna figure out what sword we want after we get our armor but yeah obviously the armor is the main concern and there we go we've already got some art okay when i say iron i thought we would have a little bit more but nope we just have one piece of iron perfect <laughs> wait there's some iron here that i completely missed on the way down okay okay let me grab that should we keep inventory on are you a bot <laughs> I mean, I'm not sure if we want to keep inventory on or not, but I mean, I'm, it's up to them. I, I don't I don't mind. Oh, it looks like Nico has left the game. I'm not too sure why exactly. I wonder if we can use this hot furnace to smelt up our other stuff, like our normal things. I'm not too sure if you can or not. If I put that there, put that there. No, okay, we can't use it to smelt up our normal stuff. That's okay. We can just go ahead and make ourselves a normal furnace. So let's go ahead, smelt this up, get ourselves some iron going here. And in the meantime, I'm going to go and look for another cave because that cave was not too good. <laughs> Nico tried to swim in lava. Oh, no. He's got a little bit of a setback. He's, I was trying to race sigils. Well, that's what you get for trying to race sigils, dude. You should know, never try to race sigils. He's always going to win, buddy. But yeah, now we just need to go ahead and find ourselves, I guess, some diamonds. And then we can go ahead and get our bedrock armor and then along with all the other stuff. But here, we got to find ourselves a better cave. So let's, let's go cave searching. Okay, guys. So I actually know this little tip. If you guys look in the top left, uh, you guys, you guys see if I'm looking at like entities and stuff, that E value will go higher. And if you're looking straight down and the E value is normally higher than eight for example like it is right here we've got like 15 there's usually a cave down there because there's a lot of mobs so what we're going to do is you know trust it because right now it's saying an e value of 10 8 and as you guys can see it's zero here but as long as we go here it's 12 apparently there's a cave down here so for any of you guys trying to find caves and stuff in the uhc's go ahead and use that e value it's completely legit because you know you're not cheating it's in minecraft and it usually works uh, let, let's see if it works if i dig down here because it says there's it says there's 12 mobs down here so hopefully we can find the cave uh but here is our e value still high our e value is gone down to zero where oh it looks like the mobs are this way okay let's dig this way then and hopefully we can find something and what did i say guys not too far off of the e value we've gone ahead and found ourselves a pretty good cave by the looks of things yeah it looks like this is a pretty low y level ravine so here let me go ahead and turn my sounds back down a little bit because that was very loud get ourselves a little bit more iron just in case and let's go and find ourselves at least three diamonds so we can get that bedrock armor i hear water <clears throat> i hear water this way so let's keep digging and hopefully you can find another cave actually yeah it sounds very very close by there we go wait what is <gasps> did we just find a mine shaft hold up this could be perfect hold on uh, oh okay luckily it's not uhc mode just yet so we don't have to deal with those doing um poison but we might be able to find a minecart chest with the diamond in it or a few diamonds nico found diamonds before me oh okay i actually got a golden apple though so that's pretty useful i <gasps> There they are, some diamonds, just what we were looking for. So one diamond, two diamonds, and three diamonds. Can we get any more? Can we get any more? Okay, three diamonds. That's actually all we needed. But look, there's more right there as well. Okay, perfect. Um, Let's go ahead, head over here, get these other diamonds, and we're going to be pretty stacked. One diamond, two diamonds, three diamonds, and four, and five. Okay, right, so let's go ahead and dig in here make our diamond pickaxe and let's oh that that is not a diamond pickaxe and let's get to mining all of that bedrock okay let's dig down to bedrock here okay there's bedrock so just to prove to you guys that we can actually break this let me go ahead and start mining with the pickaxe it's gonna take a little while you guys can see we are mining the bedrock so i think we need 24 pieces of bedrock so let me go ahead and mine all of this it's gonna take a while and just like that one piece of bedrock is broken let's go on to the second one like i said it doesn't drop so i'm gonna wait until i break all 24 pieces and then just spawn it in because for some reason they're not dropping and we couldn't figure out why so yeah we're just gonna go ahead and break them all and then we're gonna give ourselves 24 bedrock to make the bedrock armor okay so there's the second one gone now we've got a third fourth and fifth down here and also a sixth one okay this is gonna take quite a while so yeah i'm just gonna cut back once i've deleted all of these pieces of bedrock
And just like that, 24 pieces of bedrock broken. And if we go ahead, okay, so now we've got our bedrock. If we go ahead and do that, there we go. And a full set of bedrock armor, just like that. Dun, 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 dun. Oh <laughs> my goodness, I have three sets of hearts. I am immovable and I have a bunch of armor resistance. Oh my goodness, this this is pretty OP. Oh my god, look how cool we look right here. This is actually super, super cool. But now it's time to get on to our sword. So the sword I think I want to make is... Okay, so to start off, we're going to make this double-bladed sword, which does 10 attack damage and it's super, super easy to make. So let's go ahead and actually make that now if I just go like... Oh wait, I need, I need to smell up a little bit more iron, but we should be able to make that pretty soon here. Can we make diamond... Uh, any special diamond? Diamond swords, maybe? Okay, wait, so we can make the Beringser, but we need the special stick, and the special stick is needed with raw fish and a bucket, I think? Okay, yeah, 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 okay. So we might be able to actually make that if we go up to the surface, but for the meantime, if we go like this, go like that, and go like that, we can make ourselves our double-bladed sword, which is actually pretty pretty strong by the looks of things because it does how much damage? It does 10 da attack damage and it has a 1.6 attack speed. And I also want to make this ninja sword just to see what it does. And the way to do this is we need the Demezdaba steel. And to do that, we need coal and iron in this furnace, which we have a lot of. We just need to wait for it to all finish smelting up. I, I want to make a fire sword, but we're going to need fish from the surface. So that means we're going to have to go to the surface pretty fast, but we have string, so we can catch fish actually. We can catch fish pretty easily. We just need to get to the surface pretty fast. Okay, so if I want to make this fire sword, then we're going to need that glowing stuff there, which is made just by putting it back in the furnace, I believe. If we put that back in here, we can make it glow perfect. And what else do we need for this fire aura? Oh, we got to go to the nether. I'm, I'm pretty sure we have to go fast. Okay, so let's go ahead and make how many buckets do we need for that? I think we need four buckets. Oh boy, um, 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 I need a bit more iron then. Okay, so the quickest way to make a portal, if I remember, is just with buckets. So if we go ahead, take a bucket like that, put the bucket there, put another bucket there, put another bucket there, another one there, and now we have another portal, <laughs> just like that. Um, but in the meantime, I'm gonna go ahead and throw that out because we also need ourselves a, hey, let me take, wait, um, um, I broke the furnace. Uh, be right back. There we go. Back to normal. Um, we fixed our furnace up. Whoops. <laughs> Don't punch the furnace, guys. Uh, and let's get that iron there. And now we just need a flint. But let's go ahead and get our furnace and get on out of here to the nether. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, we've got everything we need. So let's just go to the nether. And hopefully, hopefully we don't die in here. Hold up. Okay, we're in the nether, and look, there's a lava pool right there, perfect. So now we just gotta make some of this. Go ahead, grab that. Okay, so that should be enough of that. Then we need to make one more bucket. Guys, this is this is getting pretty intense pretty fast, because I'm not too sure how much time exactly we have left. Now let's fill all of these buckets up with lava, and put those in like that, I believe. And then like this. There we go, okay, so we have fire aura, and now we just need to do that same thing four more times, I think. Okay, there's the second one, there's the third one. And just one more for good luck. Well, not one more for good luck. We need one more. <laughs> so let's go ahead, put those in there. And we are good to go on back, I'm pretty sure. Because we use this to go ahead and make the sword. So now all we need is the special stick, which is just a normal stick and a fish and some diamond. And we have some fish and we have a diamond. So let's get to the surface and let's start fishing for those fish. Fish, I haven't said fish so much in my life. Okay, let's get to the surface. Okay, so now we're on the surface. We just need to get our three fish. So let me go ahead and just start fishing, I guess. Yes. Okay, and just like that, we have our three fish. That took a little while. And last but not least, I'm gonna go ahead and shear some leaves for some levels, uh, for some apples. And oh my goodness, that is loud. Uh, let's just get our apples here. So to make that stick, I'm pretty sure we just go like fiery sword, special stick, uh, fish. Okay, so we just go like this, and then three fish, and then a diamond, and we got our fish oils. And now we just do a stick with the fish oils. And then we go like this with the sword and our fire aura. And there we go. We've got our fire sword. Now we just need to get two apples and we'll be ready to go. So I think I'm just going to hop back in the call with you boys. And I think it's fight time. Are you boys ready to fight? Oh yeah, let's do this. Two, three. Oh, it's getting her with that one. Two. Oh, this is going to be awesome. Go. Who is that? Wait. Oh, no, what are you? Are you wearing quartz armor? Oh, yes. Quartz. It's powerful. Ooh. 
What does that mean? Oh, ow. What's everybody wearing? Um, you know, I'm just hanging out in some bedrock armor, dude. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you have glass armor? I'm just not glass. I'm invisible. You can't see me. Go away. You can literally see the armor yeah, running around. You can't regen. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. I oh, took out. Hey, bud. Come here. Nico, what you doing? I can, I can see you, dude. What the heck up? <laughs> dude, why are you not running? Oh, oh my. Wait, so what armor do you have? Uh, stick invested? Oh no. Ow. Was that lightning <laughs> I just saw? What? Who's I striking know. lightning over there? What do you think about my sword? I think it's ugly. Did you I just eat ugly. a golden apple? Scissors. No. Scissors. Ah! Come here, boy. Come here. No! Oh. Oh. oh my goodness. Oh. That was such a big explosion. Don't you ever call me to you again. <laughs> Nico. Nico. Nico, come in, dude. Hey, Sigils. No, thank you. Sigils. Nico, why are you always on fire? Yeah, why? I don't know why I'm always on fire. Oh. I don't know if I like that. Come here, dude. Come here. Dude, you can't catch up. Come here, dude. Uh, oh, wait, what? Sigils. Wait, what? Sigils, you were so low. Nico! Dude, Nico is so fast. Get Wait! <laughs> um. Uh, Ian! <laughs> Ian! Wait, are you holding a notch apple? Wait, wait, Ian, no! No, 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 no! No, 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 no! I don't want any of this, dude. You get back here. Um, uh. Well, what I'm saying is. Anyone who's got close to you? Rock armor. What does that even do? Uh, you know, it gives me maybe thirty hearts. You know, just just a few. Oh my god! Oh! oh. <laughs> you just blew up the whole house, dude! No! 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 Okay. Okay. That's it. Come here, dude. Come here. Oh! 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 Oh my god! No! 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 What's going on? Okay, wait, um, I didn't really think this one through. I didn't really think this one through. No, no, no! <laughs> Dude, that did like 15 hearts a hit. And it did 15 hearts a hit. Oh, Dude, the desert temple is gone. <laughs> So if you guys did enjoy this like little UHC minigame thing, be sure to hit it with a like, comment down below what we should do next time, and if you guys want to see this again on the channel, as always be sure to subscribe if you're new because you know we upload videos like this all the time, and I think it's pretty fun, and if you enjoyed this video, you'll probably enjoy all my others. But other than that, I'll see you guys all again next time. Peace.